This is the Schramm Museum and Art Studio. My dad was a musician back in the 50s. He was in a quartet called The Holidays. They were pretty good. And my mom was a prolific artist. They made all the jewelry that you see here. The entire property is a shrine to all that they do. Her baskets, her jewelry, my dad's music. And I get this one little teeny section of my mom's incredible studio. Turns out I have a predilection to making earrings, who knew? my folks. They were in a situation where they didn't really have an advocate medically until I came to stay with them. My dad has Parkinson's and my mom, Helen, we call her Helen Wheels because she needs this, she needs that, she needs Lasix for her edema, she needs antibiotics. She's just a dynamic steamroller of ever-changing needs. They had the wrong medications and the wrong dosages and trying to get my mom and her wheelchair in the car to her doctor's appointments. I have a job, I work from home, but it was really hard. When we heard about Landmark, it was just a lifesaver having the doctor come to the house. It made all the difference in the world for them. Jay has got a career that he's devoted himself to. As you might imagine, the caregiving burden on someone like that is pretty significant. We're always focused on the patient, and rightly so. But I think it's really good to focus on the whole caregiving structure. Because the caregiver is always the, the stronger link in the chain. I communicate with Landmark. We schedule stuff. Trevor texts me, hey, I'm coming, you know, Friday. You can text your doctor. How cool is that? Dr. Hayes gets right back to you. This is my happiness in here. This is everything to me, my life, my happiness. We've lived in the house so long, we're part of this house. That's the goal, trying to keep them at home instead of in a home. <laughs> Landmark has been instrumental in keeping them here in their home. <laughs>